all right i'm gonna go ahead and get started hello world uh so as you might have seen from my title card i'm gonna be starting something new because we beat the ender dragon last time in our randomizer world which is this one right here and so what we're gonna do hey pirate what's up i'm starting something new we're gonna do there it is uh game oh, there 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 it is uh 
We're gonna do a hardcore world. I I should have tested this before. Hardcore. Before I started probably um I'm gonna see if I can do it with Origins mod on. So we'll see. Uh, here goes nothing. Okay, if it gives me the Origin option. Or, yeah. Okay, <laughs> we're in business. And so, the origin mod basically makes you half another mod that's in the game. And so right now I'm thinking about either going with Shulk or Avian. Or I could just do random. Should I do random? Hmm. Random. Yeah, okay. What did we get? I don't know what we got, actually. Gee. We got Indarian. So that means that I'm half Enderman. Water equals bad. This place is pretty awesome, awesome though. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, chicken. We're just gonna start collecting some mushrooms and I'm gonna see if I can find a village to near live nearby. So, probably should collect some of this wood. Get some tools going. Get a sapling or two. Cause usually I live underground. I've never played hardcore before, so let's go. I was like, yes, I've never played hardcore before. And you know what would be extra fun if I added another thing on top of hardcore mode? Like, yeah. Thought it could be fun. I wish I had a silk pickaxe. Because then I could get some of this pod soil and that'd be like super great for um uh mushrooms because I believe it doesn't matter the light level on pod soil for mushrooms. I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, hardcore but water hurts. I'm not brave enough to start out in the nether as a blazeborn. <laughs> Although I do love being blazeborn. <laughs> okay, so if I angle like this. Oh, please don't let in the water. Oh, jeez, oh, jeez, oh, jeez. Hardcore, except I almost die immediately because I teleported into a block. Oh my gosh. We're surrounded by ocean. No. Hmm. Okay. Maybe I'll dig up. Oh, jeez. I just got panic now. Maybe I will dig up another tree. Oh, that's coal and iron. Okay. We're making a crafting table right here, right now. Da, 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 da. Yeah, what exactly is it? Inchly, is it inch? Like, they're small, right? I can't dig that up. We need the rock. Okay. Oh, 
I've been thinking about trying out the extra origins because they look pretty... Some of them looked pretty interesting. This gets iron. Iron. Oh, that's like six iron right off the gate. That's pretty good. Once has one slab of height inside. Oh my gosh, just super tiny. Like, no mob will get inside because my house is too small for them. this coal. This is so much. You can live, fit in the tiny gaps. Let's, holy crap! That is really small. I did not realize how small that was. I've heard that the piglin one's pretty complicated too. Okay. We're gonna build a boat and we're gonna set to sail. Actually, before we said sell, I also want to build an axe. Alrighty. Oh, so you can have tiny stuff inside your house? That's pretty fun. I can see where, like, you'd want to do that because tiny house. I want to see if I can find a village. I think, well that looks like a desert biome over there. That'd probably be pretty good. <laughs> yeah. I can imagine, cause I don't remember what all the piglin one was. We gotta get this sugar cane. And a stick. But I, they have some sort of thing that like reduces your visibility, isn't it? I was just like, I ain't doing that. This is my all important boat. Oh, they could just, I was like, please don't fall in the water. Oh. Just hit my, alrighty. I'm sorry, sheep. Oh, dang. That was... Holy... What the heck? Axes are crazy. Alright, got enough wool for a bed. Gonna make that, too. Because then I can just sleep and skip today. cook the mutton at some point, probably. I'm sorry, big. I need it. Alright, let's see. Dig up some more trees. I should probably stop sprinting. I just keep sprinting. I'm just gonna like run out of hunger because I was sprinting. We taking these cactuses with us though. And some sand. Cause we're gonna need sand later on. For everything. I'm gonna check. Oh, jeez. I guess if I fall, I can just like ender pearl. <laughs> Be like, bam! Done. I really have landed in a wasteland though. Okay. We see. 
if there is any villages that way. Just terrified. Oh, that's right, you don't get enderpearl da like damage from the enderpearls. Because I think I was messing around in like a single player world and I did take, I thought I took damage, but I think I actually just landed funky and then took damage because I fell. That's the truth. Don't wanna, we're just gonna kill all the sheep. I'm sorry, it's just, I don't feel like I do I did get a lot of practice with the pearls because on the uh, on the origin server I we play on that's how I was getting from the top floor to the bottom floor of the hotel that I'm building I was like if I throw the ender pearl and jump at the same time It'll all work out. I might have to. St oh, that's a portal. Portal, portal, portal. Wait. Psh, psh. I'll just do this. Wait. Okay. Let me aim at the ground. Cause I was like, I could just. Pearl there, and then I was like, if I pearl there and hit the lava, I'll die. And we're gonna put our bed down right here. Oh no. Become night already. We got a golden apple clock. Silk touch shovel. Do I go back and get some pots? Oh, I might do that. Just because we're still pretty close to it. Okay. I believe it's over here. Because I want to grab some pot soil because, uh, I think it's that and mycelium you can grow mushrooms on regardless of light level. And well, I mean like mushrooms aren't like the best thing in the world. It would be nice to have some like easy access for like potions and stuff. then I could make weakness potions. Then I'd be one step closer to getting really cheap stuff from villagers. And now I've run out of sprint because I am low on food. Do I have eight mutton? I do have eight mutton. All right, let's just build a furnace real quick. And I will cook the mutton. I am going to pearl, but I'm going to eat food first. I'll dig up some trees while I wait for the food to cook because I can't spread anymore. I keep forgetting that I can just pearl whenever because I don't have the pearls in my hand. But I'm also not 100% sure where I'm going. I'll start purling after I get the food. Because I also don't want to just have, like, no food. That would be bad. I'll go check. Is that the taiga over there? Yeah, it is. Okay, it's right over there. A couple more trees. While we wait. Ok. 
Okay. Good, good. Okay, this is the last one. And then we are ready. Yeah, we take it up with this. Okay, now we're gonna pearl. it up good we're going oh yeah I should grab some of those berry bushes <laughs> because did you know that you can actually grow berries without water and since you can grow them without water you can grow them in the nether yeah, it's good times. All right, time to get some pot soil. I don't remember if pot soil spreads like in my ceiling. We'll just dig up like so. But how much should I dig up? 14. Let's stick up like 20, maybe. I remember used to thinking that <laughs> these musty things, uh, it broke. Okay, well, we got 30 of them. That's pretty good. Now we're gonna go this way. Cause the other way seemed pretty hopeless. Oh really? I didn't know that, that's cool. I'll have to keep that in mind for the next time I'm building underground bases and need pond soil. Because I was like, hopelessly being all like, I can't grow any mushrooms efficiently because I don't have mycelium. Let's see. Petrified that I will land in water. This big tree area is hard to navigate though with the ender pearls. Because there's just so many trees. Maybe if I can land on top of one of the tall ones. <laughs> the mushrooms. Did I just go in a circle? No, okay. That, those just look that way. Oh, it's just coarse dirt. <laughs> Let's see if I can land. Ooh. Let's see where we land. Da -da 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 -da. This place is huge. I hope I <laughs> maybe there's a village. Oh yes, red mushrooms. Now we can make endless mushroom sh soup. We just, I'm just gonna grab five. I don't feel like grabbing like all of them because I have minimal resource space. Not minimal, just the same. That's why I was hardcore like considering doing Shulk because it has the extra defense and then also the extra inventory. So I was like, hmm, might be a good choice. To the trees! Oh, I missed. Oh. 
Oh gosh. Every time it arcs like that, I'm like, it's gonna hit the water. I guess, so when you bump into the water as a blazeborn, it's kind of like just bumping into berry bushes. But I'm not sure if it's the same case for, uh, Elytrin. Or not Elytrin. And Darien. It's just forest everywhere. We just keep going. Da 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 da. Grab this. This. Grab in the berry bushes. I guess I could just punch them. Yeah. Oh jeez. Well, that didn't even do anything. And we go. Oh jeez. I should have started going this way from the beginning. Then again, I would not have found the one thing. What's that? More sheep? We will not kill them just this time. I really want to, I don't know, I was like, yeah, but does the big, do these place, I can't remember if they get rain or snow, and that's why I'm a little hesitant to be like, yeah, we're setting up camp now, and I also really want to, like, find a village to live nearby, just because, uh, they be convenient. And since I've never really played hardcore before, I've included a times I've died and restarted counter. Because, uh, I don't know. It'd be funny. Maybe. Right now I'm doing pretty good. I think it helps that I'm sleeping every time it gets dark. Come on, set the rest of the way, son. Set so I can asleep and avoid all mobs. Hmm. There we go. Doing pretty good so far. I've made it through like two days. What is that? Oh, that's just an island. Oh! Okay, it's okay, guys. So we've come to some ocean. <laughs> I guess we're tech going on an adventure to the ocean. In we go. Do you bet you can't put furnaces in the back of boats? So I could put the furnace in the back of the boat and like smelt some stuff. Well, that place just looks cool. Some mountains. Mountains. There's more coal in the mountains. Mountains are filled with resources. And that one has snow. Oh. Will we find a village? I don't know. If I find a village, that would be pretty cool. 
I keep, I just keep saying that. It's gonna get real annoying real quick, I feel. It's okay. I'll keep at it. We'll punch the regular dirt. And we'll use it to climb. I probably didn't need to use both of them to do that. Ooh, that's a nice cave over there. Get that coal. So much coal. I'm gonna keep my head dry. Montage. Da, 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 da. I don't know what I'm doing, to be honest. At least I don't know what to say a lot of times. I feel like part of the awkwardness is because I'm a new streamer, and the other part is because I'm just awkward sometimes. Awkward. I play a lot of Minecraft because Minecraft is fun. Dang, there's just so much. Wait. Okay, good. I was like, let me make sure I have enough cobblestone to make a new stone pickaxe when I never really break the first stone pickaxe. I'm gonna make so many torches and just be able to cook all of the things. This cave is just super cool. I want to look at it. I'm also afraid of it because I'm like, what could be lurking in here? Oh, well, it just like goes down. Does it go down and around? Okay, goes down. It's super dark. I'm sorry. I need to remember to install Optifine on fabric. I've been planning on doing that and I haven't yet. No, 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 jeez, 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 jeez. Okay, okay. Okay. I have bad luck with skeletons. Jeez, there's just so much coal on this mountain. Let's see what we can see. It's another island. Are you kidding me? How many of these islands are there? It's just island after island. Let's see if I can make it. Please make it. They made it. Yes. To get an award for farthest ender pearl throw. Can't wait to find a place to make a base. That place is pretty cool. Maybe I'll just go for cool rather than proximity to a village. Because at this point, that might be more reasonable. Hmm. I mean, that's just awesome looking. quiet. I must talk. That is what streams are about, right? Talking. <laughs> okay. So I've beat the Ender Dragon on the Skyblock Randomizer. I got, how much coal do I have? I got 62 coal. Okay, I'm just not gonna mine that coal. 
I'm not gonna worry about it because I got like a stack of it and those are llamas. Llamas. Feeling? This way. This way has good vibes. It also has the llamas. You know, you can put like the chest on the side of the llamas and I think it's so that way you can like take them with you and like be like, I guess essentially become a traveling salesman yourself. But it's like, hmm. How do I get them down in the mines? Because that's where they'd be real useful. In the mines. Just load them up with cobblestone as you're mining and then just be down there forever. Can I get to the top of there? Oh no, no I can't. It's dark. It's dark and something hit me. But, okay, I guess I just like fused into the wall for a second or something. Bum, 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 bum. Just pine trees for days, or spruce, spruce trees for days. Spruce is a type of pine though, I think, actually. So not inac- What on earth is going on here? Huh. You know? Maybe I go and find a village later. Although, I think that's a creeper down there. Hmm. But this area would be really cool. And it would get snow instead. No, don't heat yourself into ravines. This looks like a ravine that's just super open and has grass in the bottom, like a mountain ravine. Let's see. If I live here, then I can make this like my base of operations. Okay, we're gonna do it. We're gonna... This will be our home. I'll start building the ceremonial. I'll place the bed and the crafting bench and the furnace. Now it's a house. And I'll start digging up some wood. And I'll make like a little hut to start. So I could like set up like a mine shaft in one of these little random tunnels areas and build kind of like a castle down here. That'd be pretty cool. Just build something nice. I have to be careful not to fall off. I have a bad habit of falling down. This is why I often switch my shift key into the into toggle instead of just hold because I'm like if it's in toggle I won't fall down <laughs> except for when I forget that it is in toggle and just keep holding it gonna have some trees we got some Sheeps, sheeps, the We will have to find, you know, pumpkins and stuff eventually. But we start with what we got. What we got is this. 
we're gonna build a double chest. I've got berries. Okay, where do I want to build a house? So I thought that water was in, like a lake from above, but it's looking more like a waterfall situation, which I mean is fine. I'll just build a lake. Hmm. Trying to decide my game plan. Let's first start by putting away some stuff. And we can also start by... I know it's not a full eight, but it's close enough. We'll get some iron up in here. Keep that on us. Those things in there. Wait, not that. Excuse me. Take the sticks out. I need to build... I put the coal away. Now here comes the real question. Do I build the house or mine first? I'm thinking mine because like... If I don't get armor soon, I kind of am worried about the consequences of not having armor. So I'll probably do some mining. I'll start by making a bunch of pick torches, I mean torches. And so we got a stack of torches. If I had Optifine, I wouldn't need We will start with two pickaxes to begin our mining empire. And I'll just put the berries over here. Then we'll give two walking space. Yeah. Yeah, we'll start with that. Alright, time to go. Let's see, if I build the house in this general area, then I'll go mining this way. Already has that mined look to it. We're just going to place a ton of torches and we're going to place them on the ground because I don't know, that's what I always do. We got some andesite now. I feel like the important thing about streaming a hardcore playthrough is not mining off camera and then dying. Like, like that would be really dumb. So I don't know. We'll see. We'll get ourselves like a, I'll establish like a little base top side and then I'll write down the coordinates and then I'll start looking for villages and stuff. I can start a wheat farm with the one seeds I have and I can start mushrooms because I got the pod soil. Gotta check my coordinates real quick. Oh, we're at 64. Oh, jeez. We're gonna be mining a while. So I'm going down to diamond. Oh, iron! But I'm gonna go down to diamond level because that's the best place to start a strip mine is Y. I like to do Y11 
because I feel like Y12 is like the diamond vein, but if you do Y11, then it's in the ceiling. So, I don't know. That's just me. Oh, I also really like in Java because I also used to play like a lot of, or I also play a lot of Bedrock Minecraft. So I really like how in Java, you can hold just about anything in your offhand. Because it's really nice to be able to hold the torches and be like, haha, place. I might build a castle. Kind of like, I have this castle base blueprint in mind that I use in some personal builds of mine that I like a lot. And it needs like a 13 by 13 area. So it's 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 a decent size. <laughs> but since I'm not mining out the entire you know area for it to dwell within underground I should be in good shape. Yeah, Java is way better. It's like, not only is Java just like play, or just better in general, like, of what you can do, but it also like plays way nicer because uh, catching fish and buckets on Pocket Edition is borderline impossible. But. I don't know. Pocket Edition was like free to download when I downloaded it and I really wanted to play Minecraft but I didn't have like a computer that I could play Minecraft on so I was like Pocket Edition it is. We're gonna use up the wooden pickaxe. But it was fun. This is fun too. I'm pretty excited though because like Riding off that, like, beat the Ender Dragon for the first time in a randomizer. I think I'll probably. I want to throw in Hypixel into the mix. But I was thinking, like, doing hardcore and then doing some more Skyblock randomizer, maybe after playing hardcore for a bit. Because it was a lot of fun. And I, I did. I think I got pretty lucky with it. I did discover that like you have to build like a full blown <laughs> end portal to get to the end in there. Which I did which I thought you could just do like a four portal with a nether star, but then it was like not the case. And I was like Hmm I see <laughs> But I was like I already said I was beating the Ender Dragon this stream, so I was like, I can't go back on it. So I built the end portal, and I went to the end, and I beat the dragon, but it was bad because I, I wasted a ton of time because I didn't realize I had destroyed all the crystals. And I was like, oh, the the HP isn't moving anymore. I, I must be getting close. And it was because I destroyed all the crystals, but I didn't realize for a good 10 minutes. It's just like, ah, that's awkward. <laughs> oh, there's lava down there. Yes, I could just pearl. Am I going to just pour? No, I'm not going to just pearl because we're going to dig a mine. Oh, jeez, that bat scared me. I was like, holy crap, it's right by my face. It's either lava or a mine shaft. I guess I could build like a, I don't know. I guess I'm building the stairs because I want to be able to find my way back. Because in realization, I could probably just pearl up the stairs. Oh, 
Why is there so many? There's so many of them there. And there's one with armor. The heck? What the heck? Okay, okay. If I do, will I die? We about find out. Okay. So there's just lava. There doesn't appear to be any diamonds. Which I guess in hindsight, I don't have an iron pickaxe. So. I wouldn't have been able to mine up the diamonds if I did find them. One concern of mine is with how high up my base is currently, I'm worried that I'll spawn too high in the nether when I build the nether portal. I'll just be like ridiculously high up, which might be problematic, but I don't know. Maybe it'll work out in the end. I think I need to turn up my game music. I can't hear anything. But I'm like, let's do escape. Uh, options. Music and set. Start up the 50. So then I can actually hear the mobs. Yeah, okay, that's way better. Probably build a shovel. I keep running into a bunch of dirt. I can hear the zombies. Keep checking. Do, 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 do. Yeah, we ain't doing that. There's too many- there's an armored zombie over there and while yeah I could get armor for myself if I beat him. is almost broke. <gasps> Holy crap! <gasps> I don't know if he's following, but I need to make more pickaxes anyways. This is gonna take forever. Fast. Where am I? Oh no, there's a zombie here. I did it, I killed him, it's okay guys. Hello sheep. Yeah, that's just the thing, it's like it's not guaranteed to- Holy crap, why are there so many? It's not guaranteed to drop the armor. And he's gonna take more to hit, so it's just like. I risk it. We sleep now. Okay, let's see. How much cobblestone do I got? Got a decent amount. I got a decent amount of iron, too. I got 19, so I just need like five more and I can make a whole set. Okay, let's count out this area over here. Because I can move the berry bushes. 
if need be. So let's start from here. Do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Okay, and 13 is the edges that go, I think. So I do. One, two, three, four. Five. Because, wait. Let me check my blueprint. We're going to start building a base to live in, and it's going to be awesome. It's gonna be big and it's gonna be awesome. Did I? Where did I go? I went too far. Go. Albums. Let's see. Recently deleted? There we go. Sorry, I have it in my phone, so that's what I'm checking. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, yeah. That area is seven. Oops. This is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then we go over and we grab the dirt. This is also, I guess, a, a castle building tutorial now. Because that's what we be doing. I'm gonna have to probably move the berries. Okay, what I'm gonna do with this. Oh jeez, I made a terrible decision. There we go. Aha. Terrible decision resolved. Okay, I did the one. say that I am not much of a builder, which, I don't know, might sound crazy, but it's true, I swear, it's true. I just have been trying to get better at building because I do really admire like the people who are really good at building and I'm just like, I want to be good at building. And so I've been practicing. Let's do another row here. How oh, why did I do it? I gave myself two. Which is probably a good plan because berries are sharp. Oops. That one died. Okay. There we go. 
this part. Where we go, one, two. Then we do one. One, two, three, four, five. And then we drop down this tree. Cause how dare it be in our way. My axe broke. We need a new axe. I think it'd be really fun to get like good armor. I'm a little afraid of netherite mining. Because I have done it before, don't get me wrong. But I am aware of just how explosive beds can be at times. Which is what makes me nervous about doing them in hardcore. Because I'm just like, ah yes, the bed has killed me. I have failed. Okay, so then wait, do the two, and then, okay, two, let me look at this side, yeah, <laughs> two goes down, okay, so it would come in. All right, night pirate. See you later. Thanks for stopping by. Oh, I'll be back later. <laughs> All right. I'll probably stream till about 11.30. Cause that's about as much streaming as I got in these. <laughs> okay. We do one, two, then the one. Alrighty. See you around. If not, <laughs> three, four. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, jeez, oh, jeez, oh, jeez, oh, jeez, oh, jeez, oh, jeez, oh, jeez. Oh, Bring him out into the sun and let the sun take care of him. Coward. I'm not the coward. You know what I should do? Is. Well, first, we're gonna build a chest plate. And a helmet. And I think this is how you do the shield. How does one build shield? Oh, like that. Haha. <laughs> Almost got it right. Okay, then we switch these for these. Laser focus. We did it. Yay. Wait, come back, dirt. Puppies. There. Need some. Planted them instead of ate them. Then we sleep. Then we switch. 
We'll just have nothing in our hands. I just, I find it hard to see with. Oh, this is supposed to be a five as well. That's what, that's what's messing me up. Okay. Three, four, five. Then we got one. Two. Then we got dick. Yeah, then we dig across. Ooh. I'm glad that I have a bunch of spruce wood because I really like how the spruce wood looks, if I'm being totally honest. Like, the spruce store is really cool. I like it how it has that, like, dungeon y look to it. It's very fun. One, three, four, five, six. Is it seven? I think so. Is it seven? Yeah, it's seven. All right. Let me take here. Then here. I need to build a shovel. This is going to take way too long. So I don't accidentally eat that. We're going to put it there. Then we'll go over here. Be like, ah, oh, yes, this is where the things go. We'll dig it out. I should have tried harder to center it in this area. Oh well. I'm committed now. Commitment. All right, and since we're about an hour in, I don't have anything to hit. So I'll just say it while I dig. Uh, if you're new to the channel, please consider following. I just recently did a skyblock randomizer challenge where I beat the ender dragon using a skyblock randomizer, which is pretty exciting. Uh, I'm now doing Origin Hardcore, or Hardcore with a Twist, as I'm going to call it. Uh, as far as I can tell, I'm the only person who's doing this. Basically, what I'm doing is playing Hardcore mode with the Origin mod installed. I am I clicked Random Origin, and I got the Endarian, which means I'm half Enderman. I basically got unlimited Ender Pearls, have a slightly longer reach, and... The downsides, of course, to this are that water does damage to me. As you can imagine, could be complicated. Uh, I forget what the other downside is. Oh yeah, if something's wearing a pumpkin, I cannot see it. Which doesn't really matter on, on a single player hardcore world because mobs don't wear pumpkins. If I get attacked by an individual or by an indivisible, invisible mob, then we know that that's a lie. <laughs> ah, something has shot me. It's invisible because it's wearing a pumpkin. That would actually really suck. Let's, if I'm being perfectly honest, like that would suck a lot. I don't need to mind that up. That is okay. Then we go here. It takes. Right now I'm laying out the basically the outline for my base I'm gonna build. I hope that I get to build it. Partially why I am kinda 
more like, mm, yes, hardcore world. I will not do my usual thing of digging large hole underground and building base because if I die that will be a giant waste of time and also because those kind of bases are like crazy mob filled before you get them all lit up and then even after they're they're really prone to having mod mobs I keep saying mods we don't got no moderators just spiders but we gotta build okay bam bam nice we got that all situated. Put up the granite. Put that, put up this. Actually, no, not put up that and not put up this. I wish I had some bamboo. What I'm gonna do from here on out is use the non-spruce planks for making chests and sticks and stuff. And I'm going to use the spruce as flooring for my castle. Uh, I think that I'll make it just a one story castle. So that means. Oh, you know what? I'll do like a. Okay, um, I'll do a dirt staircase on the outside to get up to the, <laughs> the levels. I'll definitely leave it so like I can put more levels on later on, because that'll be cool. don't want it to be too dark. I'm a little worried about it being dark. <laughs> because uh, usually I light them up with like glowstone and stuff like that. But I obviously don't have any glowstone. We'll play it by ear. We'll play it by ear. We'll see where we get. We'll give it a cool front as well. I gotta remember when it gets dark to sleep though. Luckily I have a clock. I could just keep the clock with me. I don't wanna like accidentally spawn like a like a a bunch of phantoms. This will be our door. Yeah. Door. Okay, so usually I think I make the... I do... One. Then two for the window. And then two above, so I need it five high. Yeah, five high. We'll dig this out. I can make a two-story castle. That's that'd be cool. Slap. Slap. Slap here. Slap there. And put stairs there. And we'll make like a couple little rooms. It'll be nice. Nice little home. It's basically 
I play on this one server, and I basically have built this castle on there before. I just, I like the design. It's one I came up with myself. So I feel pretty proud of it. I like showing it off, as it were. It's actually the, started out as the design for this hotel I'm building on a different server. Oh, bad grass. It despawned. It literally just inconvenienced me and then disappeared. Okay, we go in. Do sleep. I'll do more mining here in a second. start farming uh, I should well I got the berries for now so I'll wait to start other stuff for a little bit I should plant the rest of these saplings though I am gonna need a bunch of spruce we gonna do it Start with, oh, and I did it again. Duh, duh, placing spruce planks. I just like how the spruce is like a very nice shade of brown. <laughs> and I like how the doors look all medieval and stuff. So when you like to build little castle houses, they look nice. turn this blueprint off. Then we go back to here. Ooh. See, I'm monitoring chat on both my phone and on Streamlabs because I am a proactive streamer. Ha 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 ha. Oh, wait. Don't waste resources, I say as I make all of my wood into planks. But it's gonna look so pretty! Not pretty. It'll look pretty industrial. <laughs> but it'll be impressive because I built it on hardcore. game. Then we go toggle. Then we go bam, bam. You could really build this out of whatever materials you wanted though. I'm still debating if I want to do one or two floors. Because two floors gives me more options. 
because uh, the rooms are big enough where you can actually put a fully enchanted enchantment or fully powered up enchantment table in them. And I like to build like a brewing room and then a crafting room and then some storage places. So maybe I will make it two stories, but I'll start with one story for now. But like, have it set up so I can do a second story as needed. This will be our base of operations, where we return after our long travels. Dig out this coal. Oh no, the coal has become more than one coal. <gasps> Extra coal! I'm out of spruce planks. Do I got more in here? No, we gotta mine up more spruce wood. To the top of this dirt mound. Oak trees are handy to keep around because they drop apples though. So I might need to grow some oaks. We punch out of the tree. This one needs to go because it has lots of leaves attached to it. Mm -hmm. I should probably build some doors. I should make the walls a little higher and then build some doors. That is definitely what I should do. That way mine down. I'm gonna add some farms. Than eight of these, I think actually. We're gonna need sixteen of them. So we need eight of those. Bam. Ever could I be building? Da, 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 da. Look at all these spruce saplings. Oh my gosh. There's so many. Okay, we place. Oh, those are too close together. Place some spruce saplings down. Oh, this is a water source. Okay, good. Alrighty. <laughs> I was worried that there'd be like no water source and I was just like, okay. Guess I'm roughing it. Also, while I can't fill it up fully with light, um, having it like this is pretty good. Because we put. Yeah. Let's 
I'm gonna have to dig out around the windows. I need to find some spiders so I can get some strength. Do this, this. Bam. Bam. Door. Door. I need to place down the rest of the trapdoors. It's gonna be great once it's done. Bam. Okay, that was eight. Got this, this, this. Now we're actually, instead of let's make like a bunch of pickaxes. make like 10 pickaxes real quick we'll switch to iron at some point I promise just not right now um, mainly because I used up all the iron <laughs> First things first, we gotta do some building. We got a place, build up our walls, because big walls are important walls. So, literally, what I did on I'll make like balconies, but that doesn't really work for this one. So I might do like a big window. But I mean, it'll be just like a big window that. Of what? Like, should I do a big window of. Okay. That's good. Then we're gonna get some berries. And then we're gonna go mining. Ouch. We're getting some berries though. Real question is, are they like cranberries? So that'd be cool if I could just like flood the berries like they do with the cranberries. For those watching who don't know, uh, cranberries are grown in these big bogs and when it's time to harvest the cranberries, they flood the big bogs so yeah that'd be cool if Enderman had silk touch hands that'd be kind of kind of useful I should start growing my mushrooms but get those going just don't want to like plant plant a bunch of stuff willy nilly like okay we safe Pickaxe brusque. That's okay, that's why we brought spares. So many spares. Okay. 
we going? Going down. Tunnel. Tunneling. Tunneling is been Holy crap! That's a lot of lava. Uh Right. So Hmm. Let us see. <laughs> Can I? No, I can't. I was hoping with my Enderman abilities that I could perhaps mine out a little more. <laughs> that was so dangerous. <laughs> Oh, just, oh, just. Well, that was scary and unexpected, but we made it out alive. I'm starting to seriously wonder if there's a zombie spawner nearby. Yeah, get hit by my Enderman arms, punk. Why aren't there so many of you? Punk? Now we eat some berries. Mmm, berries. Alright, we're going down. will be important later on, but right now I don't have the right mining equipment for the emeralds. So we begin <laughs> this iron. I should really make some iron pickaxes though. <laughs> but we'll leave the emerald here for now. We'll mine it out later. Let's do... Where are we at? Oh, we at F12! Cool, cool, cool. We're actually... Right where I want to be. So I went down. Just gonna mine out a little bit. Get like a starting area for my strip mine. get like a like even though water hurts me uh, I think it'd still be beneficial to carry around the water bucket because holy crap because lava also hurts me <laughs> there is unfortunately a lot of lava here oh welcome back pirate that was really fast yeah oh diamonds okay that was a weird sound I was excited though. Okay, we got diamonds there. Got some iron there. And coal there. Okay, okay. We gotta go back topside and make an iron pickaxe. Ooh, some lapis. We get the lapis though. Because we can. Lapis. I went mining for resources because I was like, yes. 
big Al Kupamai. This place is pretty good though, because I haven't even started stripping strip mining yet. And I've already found diamonds, emeralds, and lapis all in like a generalized area. But also a lot of lava. The lava scares me. Because it's a lot. Oh wait, I can do this. Up the stairs! Fast! Be fast. Oh gosh. Oh gosh, we almost found that. We did some trees up. Real question is, should I customize my skin to be like an Enderman? Because I got like a custom blaze skin. But I could make an Enderman one. Could be pretty cool. We gotta get coal. This away. Okay. I'll make an iron pickaxe here. Once that finishes smelting, in the meantime, do this. Ah, no, stop. Keep hitting E and that it's the search bar and I'm like, no, I don't want to search. I want to place blocks. We're gonna have to build another axe again. I think I am hoping if it's a six, if I get six diamonds from that vein. Which, I don't know, probably not because it looks like it's just a one vein, but you know, could get lucky. Could secretly be housing tons of diamonds underneath it, but probably not. Uh, then I'll make a pickaxe and an axe because I got iron armor. Well, I got half a set of iron armor at least. And still gotta make pants and sh Oops, I think. But we see, we see. I guess in these corner areas I don't need the planks as much. I keep just just make everything into planks. Because what I do is then raise it up. So then I can place stuff in there. And I guess I could just raise it up along the wall. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe build another shovel. We shall do that. First, sleep. Construct a better pickaxe. That I did. Okay. This is done cooking. So now I need to make the pickaxe and I'm a couple short of pants, but I can make shoes. This isn't Iron Pick. What? I feel like that's a movie reference I don't get. Ugh. Right. While you were away, Pirate, I, uh, I switched my sneak setting from hold to toggle. <laughs> Don't need this out while we're doing this. 
We'll clear, clear the grass. I'm gonna make some. I want to make a barn, but I need to like think of a good barn design. The real question is, will it just house horses or will it house everything? Because there's already like a bunch of sheep just like, or they're chilling. Let me jump so you can see the sheep. <laughs> Then we'll place down the rest of this stone. Living life on the edge. We got more berries. Always need more berries. Bam, 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 bam. I should like <laughs> record a custom follow sound. Just me saying bam, like I'm putting down cost. <laughs> oh jeez. It's a good thing that I can laugh at my own jokes even when they're not funny. Bam. Oh, I just can't stop saying it. I'm sorry if it's annoying. It's just, it's, it's too fun to say bam. <sighs> I did it again. Replace it. The blocks. Bam. Okay. Then we gotta put a block there. But we don't put parkour. Not really though. <laughs> it's kind of. I don't know. It's just a one block jump. It is because we do not want the block on top of the trap door. Because I'm going to do shutters. And they're gonna look nice. Oh no. Well, that happened. Okay. Let's pick up these spruce saplings and then plant them. And then we're gonna take our iron pickaxe. Do I say iron weird? I don't know, man. I just, I don't know. Take that. Oh, that's way too close to our house, actually. We're gonna put that here instead. Epic bar. Yes, we only do the most extreme parkour here. <laughs> oh, I just brought a bunch of dirt with me. Oh, well. <laughs> we gotta go get diamonds. And an emerald. Woo. Only just about an hour and 40 minutes in. Already found diamonds. Coming in with the... Not the dream luck. <laughs> Although they got the emeralds. Emeralds are pretty rare. If we're being real here. Of course the diamonds are right next to lava. Holy crap, what shot me? Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. F. Come at me, bro. Oh, that's a zombie villager. That is a problem. Why is it? Flee! I heal. I know. It's just, uh, 
Ah, healing bit effects. I don't want to go over here with three hearts. Because I know I don't. I don't know if I can save the zombie villager, you know? Continue mining up. No way. Oh, is that another emerald? <laughs> okay. That's, uh. And that's eight diamonds. <laughs> that's a bunch of diamonds. I don't see him anymore. Who knows what happened to the zombie villager? <gasps> no! We were doing so well! Oh! Okay. Well. Time to update the death counter. To one. And, well, that happened. <laughs> and we're gonna create a new world. It was so sudden. I was doing so, I got eight diamonds. I was gonna go so far. My house was coming along great and then a creeper blew up right behind me. <gasps> Insta death. We do it. Origin world. I might in stream now. We do origin world. No, not one, two. <laughs> Hardcore difficulty. <laughs> I was good. <laughs> Create new worlds. <laughs> Our goal is to, you know beat the game right in hardcore it's gonna be awesome it's gonna take so many tries though but we'll try again we'll try again i'm gonna keep with Darian. we'll just keep going hardcore until we uh beat it as an end enderman uh so we'll play like for a little bit in here maybe find us oh this is a flower biome that's so pretty <laughs> Jeez. i might just i don't know that was just Oh, I was chugging along. I had an awesome little house going. Not a house, not little. Decent sized castle. This place is cool. Oh jeez. That was really stunning though. It was going so well. I thought I was like, I got this in the bag. We're gonna get it so far. And then we die. We got sheep again. Hello, sheep. I'm gonna be like wary of diamonds now because I literally got diamonds and then died. Diamonds and zombie villagers because I got, like, I saw a zombie v villager and then a creeper killed me. <laughs> Creepers are the worst mod, let's be real. This biome's gonna rain so much though and I don't wanna deal with that. We're just gonna keep going though. We'll keep going. However long it takes. I might do like, I don't know. I'm gonna take a little break from the sky block. That's for sure. So we're gonna be doing this hardcore for a bit. But I might like start doing a like sky block on like Sundays, hardcore on Tuesday. Could be fun. I don't know. We're gonna just keep trying though. We'll keep the death counter up to date it's all great it's all great Tinder. <laughs> well, we can, what I can do is do hardcore with uh, the different mods and see, see how long or like how many deaths is that <laughs> okay so that's dark oak but 
since it has the mushrooms, does that make it an enchanted forest? I don't know. We got mushrooms, though, again. Mushrooms. Let's see if I can clear that lake. I did it. We're just... Hmm. Yes, I will stay determined. We'll do it. We'll get it done. Uh, knowing that the mouse will one day get the cheese fills you with determination. <laughs> Some Undertale quotes. Oh, is this a village? We already... We're already better off. This biome has rain. We'll, we'll just absolutely ruin my day. So we might not live here. But we are taking this bed. It's my bed now. We'll see about living here though, maybe. They got, well, they already got pre-pinned pigs. And this speedrunner wheat. We're gonna just take all this wheat. It's all <laughs> the guy, the sheep. Oh man, this is actually pretty nice. I might live here. Holy crap! You guys all watched me make this world. Just, just so we're clear, there was no cheating. Because that, I just got all the armor back and more obsidian than I did in the last run. In a single chest. We might live here. They got sheep and pigs. Holy crap, this one's just full of food. I don't know how to do the one where you can just grab like everything in the chest at once. Other than like breaking it. I should just break the chest, let's be real. Oh my gosh, that's a child. Please don't leave me alone, child. Enchanted for this. With pumpkins. We might not live here, but like live nearby, maybe? I really don't like the dark oak doors. Hmm. Decisions. Got a smithing table? I mean, maybe I'll just take this. This is mine now. Excuse me. Sorry for stealing your job, but not actually because I really wanted it. We ain't messing with that boy. Another benefit to living in the village, though. Oh, I can live up on the mountains by the village. So then I don't have to worry about the rain and still be in close proximity to all the stuff. Why are there so many children here? They kind of freak me out. I feel like the children villagers should have a different design. And the adults. Okay, so the village is here. There's this rather large and ominous. Oh, it's a like. It's a ravine, but like the village partly spawned in it, so it has path grass. It's pretty neat. Pretty cool. Could go mining down there. Sick. Hmm. Okay, we're gonna go look at the top of that mountain. And see what it looks like. That means the village is only like 
two pearl shots away. I want to live here where there's snow. But then we can overlook the village. And all those chickens. <laughs> And we got spruce, the best wood, in my opinion. And lava. Okay, yeah. Yeah, we'll just, you know, maybe I was too ambitious with the big house last time. So maybe we'll build a smaller house this time. But, uh... Yeah, I think I'm gonna call this mountain top my home. Then I can have easy access to the village and their people. And I can make some of them. Oh, jeez. And I heated myself off the cliff in front of everyone. Okay. With that, this, 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 this. We got five obsidian from that village. That's insane. Okay. All right. I'm gonna punch this tree down, build a crafting bench. Place said crafting bench next to my I don't even have to build stairs down to the village. I can just pearl down there. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Let's just do that and then I can check out that ravine. I might have to do something to get in and out of the ravine. Not sure yet. We will find out. I'm gonna build a house here. That is the plan. Maybe like a big pillar of the house this time though. We're gonna... <laughs> Not that that matters. Okay. Now we'll go bam, 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 bam. Chest. Sticks. Bam, bam. Bam, bam, bam. Pickaxe. E. Okie dokie. Make a bunch of wheat. We're making some speedrunner food as it were. Then I will lay down in my new bed and my second attempt at the Andarian Hardcore. I'm gonna go escape, go to end of stream page. All right, so I'm gonna wrap up for tonight. It's pretty, <laughs> we failed once already, but you know what? We'll keep on trying until we beat the game, right? And thank you so much for tuning in. If you're new to the stream, consider giving me a follow. That would be greatly appreciated. I'm trying to hit 50 followers. I think I set the, the goal day to like October maybe. So I'll figure out a way to edit that. I'm thinking about editing it, like settling it reducing the follow goal to like 20 because I feel like that's a bit more realistic. i uh, new streamer. Gonna be streaming Tuesday and Sunday nights, 9.30 to 11. 30 roughly every every week. Uh, thank you so much for stopping by and have a good night.